Let me tell you a story of a close call. I've spent the last, I don't even know, like two or three game days just collecting and processing materials. That's it. I mean, come on. It's ridiculous. But that's what you do in this game. You spend several days collecting stuff, and then you take that five cementing paste that I just had, and you put it in here because you're five short of what you need. I know. I could have cooked this chitin up. Whatever. It's cool. It's cool. I like to keep a little bit in there just because you never know when I might decide to wear some chitin stuff and uh, then I need some to repair. So anyway, I've repaired a lot of stuff in the meantime. Armor, weapons, tools, whatever. In fact, I finally remembered to switch that guy out and, and crap, it already used to be repaired again. Whatever. It's all good. It is all good. Anyway. Ah, crap. Now what am I missing? Ah, spark powder and crystals. I thought I had everything. Don't you hate that? Well, there's the spark powder. Man, I have blown through so many stones and chitin and things. Uh, let's go grab the bird. I at least know where to find the, the crystal easily enough. Ah, oh, man. But yeah, I've just, I've collected so much stuff. Oh, you need a level, do you? Oh, there you go. 162 and a half. Enjoy it, bird. It's kind of crazy. I mean, spent so much time collecting materials and, you know, just gathering, processing, etc., and then in about 10 or 15 seconds, it's all going to be gone. Um, hmm, maybe I need to go a little more east. Apparently, I don't know where to find crystal. I could have sworn there was some up here unless... No, it, even if I harvested it, you would see the little, little peg sticking up. And even at this point, it's been so long, it might have already grown anyway. I thought there was a bunch around here somewhere. Ah, oh, don't you hate that? Don't you hate that? All right, well, let's let's take a quick look. Maybe there's some... Where are you? I know there's crystal over here. I've harvested around here before. Um, I'm getting my spots mixed up, maybe? There's a big old spino down there we could go smash. Maybe I'm getting my spots mixed up, and it's in the middle of, like, a little field here, and there are a ton of raptors around. I oh, know, it's right up here. Okay, good. I guess I haven't been over to this side just yet, so let us gather some crystals right quick. As well as a few mushrooms, because why not? We might even want to grab a little more metal, just because, um... I've gone through a fair amount of metal, but we can always use more. We need 250 crystals. Man, that is a lot of crystals that we need. Hi, cat. How's it going? Come on over here. There you Hey, whoa, hello. You're spinning me in crazy circles. Watch where you're doing, or what you're doing, or where you're going, or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm just trying to say watch out, cat. That, that's it, really. That's really all it comes down to. All right, so we should have enough crystals, right? 390. Uh, we're getting pretty darn weighed down, too, so... I don't know. Um, all right. Yeah, I guess we can... We can Ah, come on, get out of here. We can we can leave this. Let me grab Let me just grab one rock's worth of metal. I mean that'll give us a hundred some odd, generally speaking. So that's not too shabby. And yeah, there we go. That's gonna turn out to be about seventy one metal ingots. So that's okay. That's not too bad. You know what? We can we can afford to carry a little bit more. Let's do one more. It's just I, I figure if I want to get a couple of rocks worth of metal, or one rock's worth of metal. I might as well get two. Wow, this one's really good. Holy cow. Wow, you just keep going and going. This is the Energizer Bunny of rocks. Look at this sucker go. Wow, bird, you're not going to be able to fly. Yeah, you will. What do you know? I guess I gave you enough carrying weight that you can fly. I'm pretty darn weighed down, and yet bird is not as much. Good deal. What do you have? 477. Wow, I was smart. Go foresight. Or maybe I did that the last couple episodes, or the last couple levels in between doing stuff. I don't remember. Seems like I gave him weight at some point recently, though. Maybe that was on the last episode, or right after. I don't remember. I don't remember anymore, but I do think we finally have everything we need to go make something else. This is probably going to be the last uh, crafting, building, heavy focus episode for at least a little while. For, I don't know. <laughs> For an episode or two. <laughs> yeah, we'll see how that plays out. I'm basically going to hang out with you here. We're going to try and get stuff ready so we can 
Uh, we're not going to have enough to do everything that I would like to do, but we're going to try and get everything ready so we can go do some more interesting stuff. That's going to involve uh, lots of shooting and dying, I, I would assume. There we go, we got ourselves a chemistry bench. Very excited to give this guy a whirl. I have a bad feeling, and I, I hope it's not the case. I don't know how that would work exactly, but I don't know. It's a standard building. I just wonder if maybe, just maybe, it's going to need gasoline to power it or, or something. I guess I gotta look through my mods and see if I can find one that's solar powered or <laughs> not solar powered, but uh... Oh, hello! I'm inside my bird. Electrically powered. I want to go ahead and say let's, um... Well, you know, we do have all these forges down here we no longer need. Here, let's go ahead and transfer all that metal over there. Got a thousand ingots in there exactly, because I took a bunch out and left a thousand. Um, why don't we go ahead and... I don't think we have any use whatsoever for these guys anymore, so we're just going to go ahead and crush them. We are going to destroy all of these guys here. We're going to get a bunch of materials back out of it, which... Uh, you know, it's all good. It is what it is. I don't really know that I need a second one of this. I mean, a, a, a second one of these, rather. I mean, if you look at it, it crunches through stuff pretty darn quickly. I mean, it's already done 15 ingots, so... Um, I don't know. I mean, a second one probably would be a good idea, just from the standpoint of efficiency. But if we put another one in here, it's going to fit in very nicely on either side. So I'm not really concerned about where we're going to place that guy. I would, however... We'll go and replace the pike for the moment. I'd like to put a chemistry bench down. So the chemistry bench is going to take up a good chunk of space here, and we'll just go ahead and put it right there next to our advanced forge. You are powered, so apparently you are electrically powered. Oh, yep, you can see the cable coming in. It's funny, the modded stuff doesn't have the, the, the power cables coming in, but the base stuff sure does. All right, so this is our new upgrade to... The Mortar and Pestle. Could have done, you know, one of the specialized ones or one of the Mortar and Pestles in a mod, but uh, I wanted to just go straight to the crafting, or the, I keep saying crafting, to the chemistry bench, because I'll be honest with you, I haven't played with the chemistry bench since it has been added. A lot of these things I just either outright ignored or I just used a modded version of something to basically get the same effect. Oh man, all these stupid things that are all piled up here. This is really obnoxious, isn't it? Wow. I don't really have a fast way to... Oh, actually, I do kind of have a fast way to do this. Here, let's let's do it this way. We can go um, like this. And then... Nope. There goes my meat. Give me my meat back. I want my meat. Gape near mine Fleisch. And then I think we're probably good with that. We'll take um, we'll take half those stones and then half again and half again. And I should probably take some. Actually, you know what? We won't even worry about the hides. Those those don't matter. We will, however, go down to our proper 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 mortar and pestle. Not the modded one that's down there, of course, because the modded one that's down there that's just for creating improved narcotics and improved. Uh, Stimulants and uh, I don't know whatever else it does, metabolic accelerators, that sort of stuff. So we're not going to concern ourselves with that one. No, 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 no. We shall concern ourselves with this one. So we are going to dump all of the flint, all of the stones, and I guess one spoiled meat in there because why not? And I'll go ahead and eat some food, even though I don't really need it. So let's go ahead and use this guy. Um, do I... Alright, what's, what's, what's the deal here? Gasoline and power to be activated. Wow, no kidding, huh? Alright. Oh, that is so much faster. That is so worth the gasoline. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was... Um, what are you? Oh, well... Take all that crap. Because... Uh, Wow, there was, there was metal in there. How did that happen? All right, take all that crap, too. Wow, that was fantastic. Here, let, let us drop in some charcoal and make some gunpowder. Oh, yes. <laughs> ah, that is so much better. 
Oh, look at that. This is great. I love this. The chemistry bench is my new favorite thing. <laughs> oh, this is marvelous. Let us just dump all that crap in there. And then uh, you have that one metal back. You can, you can take that. I'm going to take all this metal. That's right. I'm going to take all of that. We're going to dump you in there. Then, um, wow, we're only getting 34 rounds out of this. Can you believe that? Oh my gosh, 30 gunpowder a pop. I mean, at least it's appropriately stupidly expensive. I do really appreciate that with that mod. I mean, stuff like that should be stupidly expensive, but at the same time, then it just means all I have to do is run around and do this forever. I mean, come on, we end up spending a bajillion time. Well, I do. I spend a, end up spending a bajillion minutes of my time just running around collecting flint. And honestly... This gets kind of boring. I mean, yeah, I know. I, I should go get a Dodicarus or um, uh, mm, an Ankylo or something. I get it. I know. But then I have to get rid of my cat because I'm playing with dumb rules. So I can't do that. I mean, obviously I can't do that. I mean, I could do that, but I can't do that. You know what I mean? I can't do that. So I don't want to do that. So instead, I run around doing this, which, you know, it, it would be really nice to get a really high-end pick. But, uh, you know, it's okay. Overharvesting isn't a thing like it used to be back in the very early days. If you never played in the very, very beginning days, then you've never really played when overharvesting was a true thing. Overharvesting's been changed since then. Let us go ahead and grab the pike. Where are you? Just put that back down there. And we'll just kill one more stone here for a little more flint. I would just like to go watch that that chemistry bench just chew through things one more time. That really entertained me. No joke. Oh, you're level 120. You can spit at me all you like. There's actually something else I would like to do, and I don't think I have the materials to do it, so that's kind of a shame if that's the case, but uh, I'm pretty sure it is. Um, no, I don't want hides. I want meat. We'll go with meat. I think that's the right tool. I think that's the, the, the meat tool. I think the pick. I don't know. I ended up getting more hides anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Let us run back over here. You know, we can almost dismantle that guy over there. Almost. We are really close. I, I just need to build a new fabricator, move a bed, uh, build a new advanced mortar and pestle, uh, transfer some stuff in storage. Um, just do a few things, really. Not, not a whole lot. Oh, my gosh. This is... <laughs> Oh, I could sit here all day watching this. This is so satisfying. Do you ever see those dumb videos? Most satisfying video in the world. Most of them aren't. This one, though, this one for me is immensely satisfying. Because now I'm going to do this. And yeah, I know I didn't need to wait. I could have queued it all up, but I wanted to do it all at once. And now look at that. Look how quickly this guy's going. I am not going to sit here for another 150 more of these. But holy crap, that is impressive. Here, we'll take those 306 gunpowders. And then uh, here, ammo, tactical rifle bullet. Whip me up a few more of them, guys. Wow. That is just marvelous. I am, I am so in love with that. That is just the most amazing thing ever. I'm going to collect a couple more items of cementing paste and polymer here, and I don't think I have any more anywhere else. What about you? Do you have anything? You do have some ingots still. That's good. I'm pretty sure I checked this guy, and I pulled whatever I had out of there, which included pulling that metal pick out of here. I had forgotten I had it in here, so I was glad I checked in here. You can see I dropped my, my regular pick back in there. What do we have in there? A lot of wooden walls. I, I need to use those still, so we'll get around to that eventually. But I do want to give you just a quick taste of one more thing that I would like to build. And um, we're not going to have the materials to do it today. I need a lot more cementing paste because I need to make a lot more polymer. And I guess we could play the organic polymer game, but um, I don't know. That that would take just as long, it, it sure seems. So I'm actually putting all that junk back in there. Just because I would like to check and see what is it going to take here. Oh, man, this stuff is expensive. So, obviously, I'm looking at riot armor. This is the basically highest armored stuff in the game. Now, compared to some of the stuff we're carrying, like, obviously, we don't want to do a new riot chest piece because that would be that would be a, a bad thing. That would actually lose us some armor. So, 
we went to basically everything else, however, that would be an improvement. And uh, nothing else. I would just kind of like the a different look of things. So I do have a little bit of chitin in here. I do have a little bit of chitin in the smithy forge. Smithy forge. Smithy. I think it's a smithy. I think I said forge earlier. Smithy. And that would actually get us a little bit of cementing paste, but not enough to really make a lot of polymer. And then, even then, I'm going to run out of pearls here before too long. So, oh wow, you take crystal for the helmet too. I guess I understand why, and that kind of makes sense. Wow, that is just some craziness right there. Some absolute craziness. Let me just grab a couple things in here. Yeah, I'm going to put that fire out. Let's grab that charcoal. How's this guy doing? Oh, did I forget? Oh, look at that. I do have a bunch. Wow, did I... What did... Did I not grab everything from here? What did I do? What in the world did I do? I, I pulled that crap out of somewhere else, apparently. I don't know what I did. I'm so confused. Let's put you in there. And, um... I'll put you in there, too, because I think that might be a good idea. I'm going to need some more... As a matter of fact, here, just for giggles. Even though I don't think we really need these anymore... Because we have some modded stuff that'll basically replace this stuff. Just for giggles. Because we haven't done it in a while. There we go. Make 45 improved narcotics. I don't know what to do with them. But we'll figure that out. Eventually. And then, um... It's actually going to work out just perfectly there. That's, that's not too bad. Here, let me take a bunch of these back. I don't really need them in there after all, so... Guess we could technically dismantle that if we really wanted. I don't, I don't really want to do that. Oh, that's right. I had two of them. I forgot it. Wow. Are you kidding me? I spent... Uh, yes, that means I spent all both of those days only using one of those dumb things. Uh, I totally forgot about that. Don't I feel like an idiot? Oh, well, what can you do? I want to lose some of this stuff here. We're just going to get rid of some of this junk. Do a little bit of uh, house cleaning. Something I keep meaning to do, and maybe I can find it somewhere. I don't remember where it is. Maybe it's um, maybe it's up here. We should probably do this. I, I meant to do this earlier, and then, you know, Squirrel forgot about it. There we go. That's what I want to do. I want to make a, a quick refrigerator today. Should probably make a modded one, but I think I'll be okay with making a standard one. So let's just go ahead and drop some gas in there, and then we'll turn you on, and we'll craft ourselves a nice refrigerator. We're only going to do one today. We should probably do several, but we're only going to do one because um, eh, one will be sufficient for our purposes, I think. So I'm going to grab all the eggs and other things I can find here. Trike eggs, Titan Boa eggs, Dodo eggs, Pulmonoscorpius eggs, Bronto eggs, and I think that's okay. I'm not really going to worry about the stuff that's going to spoil in terms of spoiled meat. Or just the regular meat that I'm going to let spoil into spoiled meat. We'll just let that go. It doesn't take too long to spoil meat that I don't really feel like I need to save it. I, I don't really want to do that. That that would just that would just take too long. Bird! Bird! This this doesn't work for me. There we go. Nope, not quite. Bird? Bird! Ah, crud. Here. Can I can I get you to walk around just a touch for me? There you go. Thank you. Ah, that did not work well at all. So we have the upstairs here. Well, oh, crap, I can't even get around. Let me try that again. We have our upstairs area here. Don't look at the light. Ah, that is bright. No joke. That is bright. Um, upstairs is where we're going to be putting our food and water business and that sort of thing. So, I don't know. Maybe we'll do a, a beer still or whatever it's called in the game. I don't know. Not sure we really need to. But I think over here in the corner, we'll go ahead and start with the corner over here, and this is where we're going to slam our refrigerator down. So, refrigerator. Oh, that is one big fridge. Look at that. And there we go. We have ourselves a refrigerator. This guy is powered. So now we should be able to go ahead and drop you in there, and you will spoil in a long time. I'm going to throw all of these eggs in here, and yes, I, I realize I threw that meat in there. I just wanted to make sure. So look at that. 680, 91 days. Yeah. Okay, those are looking good. So this is kind of the important thing right here. Let's let's be quick about this. All of that, which might not seem like much, until you realize that Birdface over here is carrying all the prime meat, all the raw prime meat. Birdface really has all the raw prime meat. In fact, even has the cooked prime meat. Yeah, I've been using the bird as a uh, poor man's refrigerator for quite a while now. 
So there we go. We got a bunch of junk in there. Let's just rearrange things just a touch. I really would prefer to have eggs at the end just because I don't really care. And we'll mostly ignore them. We'll just leave the good stuff up front. Crappy meat, good meat, raw prime meat. Look at that. That is not bad. That is not too shabby right there. We got a bunch of raw prime meat, which uh, theoretically wouldn't be too big a deal to get out to something to feed it. Obviously, kibble would be better, but, um, you know, in the interim, it'll be fine. And here, I'm actually going to go ahead and just spoil this stuff out just to have a little more. Because we can go ahead and load up our chemistry bench right now. Oh, man, this thing is just... This thing is a kick in the pants. Do I have... What do we have over here? 299 of these guys. And 299 of those guys. Those guys. Those guys have a lot of berries on them. Those guys. And you have a lot of spoiled meat on you, buddy. Thank you for holding on to that for so long. I, I really appreciate that, actually. And thank you for holding on to that for so long as well. Oh, and those berries. We'll go ahead and take those. And I should probably take those pelts just to get them off of you. I feel like the cat needs more health or more damage or both. So we're going to give you more damage for right now. And then let's go play with the chemistry bench one more time. Uh, all that meat will spoil momentarily. I'm not really overly concerned about that. Drugs. Narcotics. We're going to craft 30 batches of narcotics. It's six a pop. Oh, man. This is just... This makes me so happy. I mean, look at that. Every time it goes click, 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 another six narcotics pop up. Oh, I wish I had this earlier in the game. This is just... This is something else. This is really something else. Well, let's take the last batch we have of our gunpowder... And I guess we can probably make some more. Um, I probably ran out of spark powder, though. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. Well, here we go. Make 78 more times something narcotic. Or times times something gunpowder. And then we'll just go ahead and... Um, oh, I have some more metal to put in there, don't I? Weapons! Ammo! Tactical rifle bullets. 58 of these guys. Look at that. We are going to have... Oh, somewhere around a lot of those. That's going to be fantastic. Here, you need something to do. Work on that, my friend. Work on that. And then I guess I should put that those stones in there. And uh, these ingots, I guess these ingots can probably go in there because that's where they're going to be needed next. And then uh, gunpowder. No, uh, cementing paste. Yeah, I'll need to take that back with me to, to the fabricator. Wow. So I'm going to try and whip out some riot armor before we get together next time. And theoretically... Theoretically, we're going to be okay here. I, I would actually... Let's see. 171 plus 19, that is 190. I wouldn't mind repairing that guy for one. I, I mean, it's not all that bad off, but I wouldn't mind repairing it for one. And uh, I think I'll just go ahead and do another round of, I don't know, a couple thousand ingots. I mean, it, you saw how long it took to get... 500 out of that one rock. I mean, usually it's in the 100 or 200 area, but if we get one of those, couple of those big ones, that doesn't really take me that long to gather that. And then, uh, yeah, so I'm basically going to go gather some more stuff. <laughs> That's what it comes down to. I'm going to make some more ammunition. I'm going to make some armor. And then the next time we get together, I think we're going to go on a killing spree because, oops, you don't belong in there. Because that's how we're going to roll. So I'll catch you on another one. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.